nurses and other technicians. The hospital is made of bamboo with a canvas roof, but all equipment is the most modern. A dentally equipped setup. This hospital is as fine as any in the United States. There's a large staff of trained nurses. There's every kind of medicine in this efficient pharmacy and a staff of experts. A laboratory technician is going to make a blood test. For our boys don't only suffer from wounds, many of them fall victims of tropical diseases. United States Signal Corps cameramen show technicians studying the blood specimen to identify microbes, if any are present. A fluoroscope to detect lung and chest ailments. Actually, there is nothing that is lacking in this hospital in the craggy mountains of Burma. As the fight against Japan rages, the casualties are numerous. There are casualties too in the course of the hard labor required to keep the Burma Road open, so surgeons are busy all the time. As long as friends and relatives can't come to call, doctors and nurses serve as visitors and cheer up the boys. You're going to be fit as a fiddle, says Doc. Daily exercises will make fingers fit as new. A Red Cross worker brings gifts. All this gives everyone a good idea of why funds are needed for the Red Cross and why blood plasma is needed. When we buy bonds and contribute to the Red Cross, we give new life to our sick or wounded men. John G. Shackleford, brilliant Cleveland attorney, assumes office. He has been named president of the newly formed United States League of Negro Ball Clubs, raising teams of six and two associate teams. Included are teams of Detroit, Chicago, Buffalo, St. Louis, Philadelphia, and Pittsburgh. <laughs> Hilda Bryant, executive of Phi Delta Kappa National Sorority, presents a medal to Evelyn Boyd. In addition to the medal, Miss Boyd, a Washington, D.C. girl, wins a scholarship to Yale University. <laughs> Dr. J. Price McCain, Pittsburgh physician and dog enthusiast, raises prize colleagues. He has won many awards for them in the 18 years this has been his hobby. He took many first awards in Madison Square Garden last year and has his dogs in the movie. Mrs. Price attends to the feeding, which is all important. One of the prize dogs, a champ herself, has produced six other prize winners.